Hello, everyone. This is Jeff from the Cybersecurity and IT Professional Podcast, where industry leaders share their insights. It's six qu questions in under 10 minutes because hackers never sleep. So let's jump in. Question number one. Nicholas, in a few sentences, can you please tell us who you are and what you do? Sure thing. Uh, Nicholas Hughes, you can call me Nick, uh, CEO of EITR Technologies. Uh, we are a consulting company specializing in cloud automation and cybersecurity. Uh, so running that thing. I'm also an open source enthusiast and a cloud automation guy. Excellent. Question number two, what is the best thing about leading your own cybersecurity company during these very interesting times? Well, I'd have to say it's, it's the money, the fame, you know, getting stopped on the street for autographs. Uh, it's all very important. Uh, no, I mean, it's, it's all about helping people, right? You know, um, having a cybersecurity company, we're, we're protecting things that are important to organizations and people. Well put, well put. Question number three, we hear from other industry leaders that cybersecurity is a top five concern and only getting bigger. What does that mean to you? Um, cybersecurity being a top concern really means um, enabling business by mitigating risk, right? Um, you know, your, your company isn't formed to do cybersecurity things generally, unless you're a cybersecurity company. Um, so, you know, whatever it is that your organization is doing, you know, how do we mitigate the risks involved in doing that? You know, the ways that we do business, how do we make them safer? Yeah. Uh, question number four, what insights about technology by the people for the people would you like to share with our audience? It, it's really that, that everything ultimately is about people. And, you know, we need to remember that, uh, you know, information technology in general is, is for people, you know, it's, it's to enable them to do their jobs um, better, easier, faster, uh, whatever that is. So, you know, ultimately, we need to understand that the people are at the end of this. And so when you're involved in the security of an organization, um, you need to keep that in your sights because if you sit in your tower and you know start looking at the technological aspects of the job, which are many and get a lot of press, um, you know you're you're not going to make decisions necessarily that that help the people at the end of the chain. So you know always keep them in mind. Um, you know, if, if you're if you're locking things down, you're you're choosing uh, some sort of uh, technical control that's going to to lock down parts of your enterprise. Um, you know, how is that going to affect people on the other end? Is it is it going to enable them, or is it going to prevent them from doing the things that they want to do? Good thoughts. Good thoughts. Uh, in your experience, what other successful cyber professionals like yourself uh, would you like to acknowledge and uh, might be a good guest on our podcast? Oh, man. Um, probably got a few off the top of my head. Uh, Chris Hughes, no relation. Uh, he's a really good guy. Um, he might be a robot. I've been speculating on that uh, in recent days. He, he's really active on LinkedIn and always has a lot of really good content that he's read. Um, but the only way that you can read that much content and actually absorb it is if you are in fact a robot, uh, AJ Yon, uh, is a great guy also, uh, startup out of Miami. Um, so doing really interesting things, making compliance suck less. And, uh, Nick Lumsden, uh, he's always a good guy to, to follow around on LinkedIn too. So he'd probably be a good guy to talk to. Wonderful. Thank you. Uh, and our question number six and our final question. What is your favorite piece of retro technology that makes you smile? Oh man, um, it's probably a few, but I, I, I got to go with Super Nintendo, man. I mean, 
all the way. It's the Super Mario World is probably one of the greatest games of all time. And if you don't agree with me, we're going to have to fight because, you know, it's just, I, I, I look back on that and think, you know, I, I spent, not wasted, spent so much time playing that game over and over and over again with my brother. Uh, and that's the reason that I still have a Super Nintendo is for that game. Brilliant. Brilliant. Uh, what is the best way for viewers to learn more about you, your company, what you do, or just get in contact with you? Absolutely. Um, so we have a website, eitr.tech, that's T-E-C-H. And uh, on that site is also a link to my LinkedIn profile. Uh, and I'm pretty active on LinkedIn. So you know, always happy to chat if uh, you want to connect with me and, uh, and message me there. Fantastic. Thank you, Nick. We really appreciate your time today. Uh, for everyone else watching out there, make sure to check out more episodes and insights from the Cybersecurity and IT Professional Podcast. Again, my name is Jeff. Thank you very much and peace.